So this is the Pixel Experience Plus unofficial build for Redmi Note 10 Pro and in this video we're gonna see how does it performs in my Redmi Note 10 Pro. So if you are new to this channel and watches content regarding to custom ROMs, MIUI and any tech tips and everything technology related then you must subscribe to this channel without any issue. So let's get started with the video and let us see how much it performs damn greater so now i am on android version section as you can see it is based on android 13 yeah, although it is an unofficial build but it surpasses everything and it performs damn great performance it is equipped with the security update of march 5th and the kernel version of vantom kernel is being used you can see that in the thursday march 23 built over there and the build number is as mentioned over there and now talking about much more let us talk further more about the smoothness so yeah this rom is perfectly what do you say stabilized for the smoothness as you can see that i am on the 120 hertz display and you can't see any sort of jitter lag and anything the opening closing animation were super smooth you feel there is no stutter lags you can feel so ever now let us talk about the customization part so in this pixel experience room we all know that pixel experience doesn't provide much more customizations only few of such customizations had been given in this sort of rooms here you can see gestures options over there and the buttons these were the all the normal customizations that everyone's known this is the status bar you can uh, use according to yours and there's thermal profiles i will talk about the thermal profiles in the later part of the video so be with me in the video does it perform or not so talking about that firstly i want to st uh, start with the screenshots of the benchmarks that i've took so far and and here it comes so what do you say screenshots and yeah so this is the l1 certified uh, room which means that you can prime netflix and everything works fine in this device with the full hd content now let us move forward this room is certified there isn't issue with the safety net status even though cts profile does passed so no issues with those who are using banking apps google photo spoofing is available i already full 94 percent of the storage but still i got in much storage available now this is the benchmark result that i have took with the normal mode which means no gaming profile no optimization profiles of the device as you can see that the single core score is 556 and the multi core score is 1591 you can easily see that now talking about that this is the reduced score as you can see that it is, has been took with the optimization profiles of what you say performance profiles of the device so it is not damn great the optimization profiles of what you say thermal profiles doesn't provide much more good performance although this is the wildlife test that i took so far and the average frame rate is 6.80 fps that is so good i'm not happy with the slingshot extreme and open gls 3 point test and also slingshot because if you can see that it only gives 47.60 fps which is not good this is a storage speed test of the antro 2 okay now talking about the antro 2 scores you can see that 3,44,802 scores but in other custom rooms apart from pixel experience the scores are getting greater you can see that gpu is 97,874 and there is a 2.1 degree celsius upper temperature with the 3% of the battery drop that is all around okay but not happy with the scores but all time i can say that scores doesn't matter every time with the performance now this is the cpu throttling test and i have been running through 100 threads for 15 minutes although it is to uh, taken 14 minutes but cpu throttle 88 performance max performance and the max is 153 gb ips which is also good now talk about the charging stats as you can see that i have already talked about that so you can see that from 10 to 100 percent rate i charged my device for 90 percent and it took almost one hour 15 minutes so 33 watt charging does not work fine it charges slowly so in my recommendation the charging and the battery consumption of this device is not good as you can expect this is the mui camera and there is no issues with the camera application there is aren't a what do you say green tint blue tint any sort of issues the 64 megapixel is working i am having the 10 pro variant so i got a 64 mp camera and if i talk about the settings and let us talk about the network internet settings so we haven't faced any issues over there i using it from the last three days and the connected devices option is there applications you by, by default gets the pixel launcher 
nothing new battery i already talked about you can see the battery usage from here also i am not with the happy with the battery performance although the performance of the smoothness of the device is too good you get the mi sony nether that is working all around but in my what do you say recommendation it is not as good as what you want what papers and styles is given you can change your color palettes according to you like i have just been changing over the upgrade option there not much more is available and there is accessibilities option in accessibilities nothing more new has been added although there are same things in the systems option you can see that there is no updater because this is not a official build so ever and the thermal profile already talked about that is not a working useless thing in the gestures option already talked new not new new things had been added in the languages and input you can see that the app language is there and there is not what do you say much more app language support is given few roms provides much more app languages but in this uh, room you are not getting so ever so this is the my full and final review of this pixel experience plus unofficial uh, room for this redmi note 10 pro sweet sweet in and in my recommendation you can use this uh, room on your device there is not a, many drawbacks in any such things but what i can say if you are heavy users and consumes battery much more then don't use this and if you not then you are good to go with this so if you really did enjoyed watching this video please give a like to this video and subscribe to this channel for more sake of content so i'll be going to meet you in the next video till then